Hey, what up, group? It's your man Argat coming at you with another episode. Um, this is going to be a uh, heavy hitter action from our war against Mary Kotkat. Uh, they are the development sister feeder clan for Suomi Kotkat. Uh, they will be in the uh, CWL Season 3 faux show. Um, <clears throat> and their main clan is an invite clan. So, you know, uh, good solid competition. Uh, they took it to us. Only missed these uh, four stars here at the top on our 11th and restart everything else. So uh, hats off to the guys over at Mary Cockcat. Nice war. Um, so let's start things off here at the top. Uh, get into this uh, Queen Walk Gobo from Min. I uh, was going to start things off. with a hay spell right here and three balloons uh, tried to get this archer tower out but got an unfortunate split on his loons um, but still got the funnel set for his queen uh, queen goes down she's gonna walk all the way around like this into the base gets amazing value out of this queen walk um, Unfortunately, he had to burn the ability a little sooner than he liked. With those, he needed to drop the rage now. Like, dropped it way too late. Uh, but hits the ability just in time to salvage the raid. <laughs> uh, it was incredible how close to a fail that was. A uh, bit of a wasted giant out here. I think he might have been checking for a bomb or something. Uh, not entirely sure. I'll have to ask him. Uh, but the uh, queen walks just, she's just doing her thing. Uh, CC Pole is going to come out here shortly when the Queen steps up to take out that Expo. So we'll speed through this a little bit. Drops that Rage down uh, a little earlier this time. Learned his lesson. Uh, gets the Poison down on the uh, Hound and the Loons. So, <clears throat> Hound pops. No big deal. Queen's just hanging on. Uh, goes ahead and starts off with... Uh, There's a giant and a golem down here. Golem out here. Uh, CC bowlers come in. Gets the wall break in on the corner. The bowlers take out this elixir collector and pushes everything back in. Has the jump and the rage down. Freeze on the inferno there. Bulge just wrecking face. Still has all his healers up. His queen's still alive, I think. Yeah, she's full health. Um, she's going to step out and knock out that Inferno Tower. He's going to pick off one more building. And that's going to be all she wrote. Almost gets that elixir storage. Just not quite enough from those archers with the skelly trap. But nice job, man, throwing down a 60% on a 109k Town Hall 11. Awesome job. And Sudzy. <clears throat> Coming at it with the uh, Gobo as well. Drops down a minion, soaks up a uh, uh, an air bomb, pops the Tesla, uh, sends in a hog here for the CC pole, which is very nice. Drops down the archer out here, pulls the hound over to the corner, drops the baby dragon down, which is awesome. That hound's just going to sit there and get wrecked. <laughs> nice. Uh, shout out to my man Mix from uh, wherever he is now. I think he left his last clan, so. Um, drops down that poison for the hound pop. It's very nice. Um, unfortunately, started his gobo a little early. And it pulled the hound away, and he lost his baby dragon. Uh, so golem and bowlers in here. Golem and bowlers in here. Rages down for both of them. Uh, third golem in here. CC bowlers, queen down, picks off that last, po uh, last loon. Dropped a third rage down here. Beautiful funnel. I'm sorry, not the third rage. Jump down here to get into the town hall. So two rages and a jump, still has a jump and a heal, or a rage and a heal left. <clears throat> Just 
working on that uh, eagle artillery there. Goes down, drops the heal spell and the rage. Pushes everything right on in. It's a beautiful funnel set, man. So already has the 50. Uh, Queen still has her ability. She's locked onto the king, though. Um, burns the ability there because the queen, the enemy queen, locked onto her. She's just hanging on by a thread and picks off the town hall. Wow, 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 wow. <laughs> but now there's nothing to shoot at the queen, so she's going to get a couple more free percentage points. Uh, Sudsy brings home the 61% uh, on a 109k. Awesome job, Sudsy. Nice hit, man. All right. And now for the oh, 99 and 91. Rough break, Porsche. 94 from Bay. Damn, man. All right. So now we'll get into 3i. Uh, Gobo Lalo. CC Golem comes out right in here. Sets the edge with the Wizzies. Gets that building to go down there. Uh, setting the other side of the funnel with the Wizzies here. Uh, drops down the Royals and the Bowlers. Jump spell down here to push them in. So it has a heal, a poison, and six hastes at this point. Uh, <laughs> so it hits the Warden ability as they come across that first Inferno Tower. Uh, bowlers kind of walked on him a bit. Uh, Queen redirects, though, to come back into the base thanks to the Hound. <laughs> it's kind of funny. Um, so he goes ahead and starts the Lalo. Loon in here, or Hound in there. Loons, Hound in here. Targeted loons around. Haste, haste. You're just going to see the base covered in haste. Uh, three more loons here. Another haste here. Uh, hits the queen ability up here dealing with the hound. She's going to step up and get it. Oh, is he? More loons and a haste here. Queen picks off the other inferno tower. Another haste in here pushing into the last air defense. I mean, just haste spells all over the place. So, now there's just an archer tower left. And it's busy with a baby dragon. Uh, so the skellies actually pick off all of his balloons, but he's got enough pups and a baby dragon down at the 6 o'clock spot, 7 o'clock spot there. Queen is down, still has the warden and a pair of baby dragons and enough pups. This one's probably a little closer than he wanted it to be. <laughs> but uh, King goes down, everything flies back over to that four, or they got 5 o'clock spot there, and 3i brings home the triple on an 89k Town Hall 10. Nice job, 3i. And now for the last one. Three I here on a fully max 10, 90k. Mass miners? What? <laughs> That's awesome, man. Uh, so taking the free percentage points where you can get them early. Archers all fanned out. Just tons of free percentage points there. It's going to make it really easy to funnel his miners into the base. Uh, sends the king in here. Again, nothing shooting at him. Uh, queen's going down here. So he's setting the edge here to push in this way. Five heals, a rage, and a poison. Oh, came in on this side. I lied. So miners just came in here, rage down into the first Inferno Tower, uh, CC pull is out, he's hit the Warden ability, dealing with the first Inferno Tower there, uh, heal down for the Queen, out uh, for the Queen kill, uh, all his miners are sitting in heals, has the heal down uh, for as soon as that Inferno Tower goes down, uh, heal down in the core here, and last heal down here with the Wizard Towers. <laughs> God, heals all over the place, man. Uh, so it has a couple of miners out here. This hound is just doing no damage to his warden. Uh, <laughs> so it's just a matter of the miners wrecking their way through the rest of the base. Did a great job picking off the free percentage points, keeping the miners in the base and focused. Uh, and there's just too much miner left. Way too much. Look at all those miners he's got left, man. Warden's still up. The hound never kills him. 
and he has a full crew of miners tunneling through the base and just absolutely smashed it with 45 miners. <laughs> awesome job, 3i. Very well done, sir. All right, guys, so that's going to wrap it up for this heavy hitters episode against our from our war against Mary Cockat. Uh, if you saw at the beginning of the video, uh, we matched up against Mecha Alliance. Uh, we got some work to do for sure, but uh, plenty of attacks left. Um, so this one's still winnable for us. Just need to be perfect from here on out. Um, so I'll be back with more from this war a little bit later on. But until then, that's going to do it for this one. Thanks for watching, everybody. I'm out.